Hello, this is Rob with Rocky Mountain Sewing and Vacuum. I am here. We have just an, an amazing bundle and an amazing package that just came to light a couple of days ago uh, on one of my favorite machines of all time. Don't tell anybody I said that. My other reps will get mad. But this is the Foff Expression, Quilt Expression 720. So I'm going to do something a little different and talk about my bundle first. It's an amazing bundle. This machine, the MSRP is $47.99. I have a $1,055 bundle that I'm including with this. So what it's going to include is the extension table with guide, which is awesome. It's going to come with this circular attachment along with a, attachments, a circular attachment uh, template kit and the 5 8 quilt bundle as well as, and we just got news that these are coming, so I have pictures of what else is coming. Uh, we have this sweet... A uh, bundle that's going to come with the um, healing mats, a rotary cutter with extra blades, uh, some needles. It's a $249 value. So $1,055 worth of goodness with this. It, a $2,100 instant rebate. Foff, like everybody else, has criteria about what I can say for pricing. So it's $47.99, a $2,100 rebate. I'll let you do that math. And it includes a $1,055 uh, value bundle. These machines were used for a three-day uh, quilt show somewhere else in the country. And I bought all of them because I think it's an excellent value, an excellent opportunity to buy this beautiful machine. Uh, the 720, I'll tell you why I like it and I'll show you some things. It has 10 inches of space right of the needle. It has a very large uh, color touch screen and some other features that I'll show, but more importantly, it has the Foff dual feed. Uh, Foff has had the dual feed, I think, since the 60s. I've been talking about this forever. We, I have a, a really weird video on YouTube that has a lot of views of showing the dual feed. I'm going to try to do it a little better today. Before I forget, in case you're wondering why you would want a circle attachment, again, last minute we couldn't grab samples fast enough, but these are some quilts that were made using the circle attachment, and I think it's just a really unique look and very interesting. So I think it's a great uh, thing to include with this. So what I'm going to show you here is Foss dual feed. Feeding equates into power. So sometimes people will call and they will say, you know, I'm looking to do something like handbags or something like that. And I don't necessarily go to a machine that has a lot of piercing power right off the bat. I show, usually talk about a dual feed machine because feeding equals power, but also the dual feed will help feed your fabric better. So, you know, a lot of times you start out like this and then at the end of your seam, you end up like this. It's because you're relying that you're hoping that this foot is going to exert enough pressure and enough friction on your bottom fabric, uh, top and bottom fabrics to keep them together. And of course you get slippage. So I'm going to try, do my best here to show you what that looks like. Um, so as, as I sew, you can see it feeding. If I go to a really long stitch length, oops, let me just increase my stitch length a lot here. So you can really, you can see it takes a longer, it just follows the bottom feed dogs. If I reverse, guess what? It reverses. So it will always follow the bottom feed dogs. Uh, what's nice about this machine, I don't know if you've noticed up on my screen, this has an automatic presser foot lifter. Um, so it, there's no lever in the back you have to mess with. So if I push it up, it goes up. One more bump gives you that extra high lift. And then of course down is down. And then, um, so it makes it really nice. And there's a couple other features I like to show while I'm doing this. This has an automatic needle threader. Whoops. Even for blind people like me, we can, we can thread a needle. And put this up. So what I'm going to show you, this denim here is not, um, is not weak denim. It's not stretched denim. This is like cowboy denim. This is the real thing. I can't remember how many ounces this is ever, but it's, it's great. It's really heavy denim. And what I'm going to do is try to emulate kind of like if you're hemming jeans, you have that, that hump on that seam. So what I do here is I'm going to put my foot down. What I love about this machine, it has automatic tie off. So as I start, whoops, you do have to put your settings back to normal. Mm -mm -mm. It's got a nice touch screen. So as I sew, I can automatically tie off at the beginning of my stitch. It goes two down, two up, and then starts my seam. So I'm just going to quickly do this. And at the end of my seam, I can hit my scissors button and it automatically ties off 
cuts my top and bottom thread, lifts my presser foot, and you can't really see probably, but it pulls both tails to the back. So I'm going to fold this over. And I've probably done this presentation in my lifetime since the early 90s, 8 million times. So I love showing the Foff dual feed. Um, I'm going to change this to a straight stretch stitch because I think that looks like a really nice top stitch. It's going to tie off. And again, if I stop with this, it's kind of cool. You can see it automatically. If I wanted to pivot, I can just tap my foot control and it raises it up just enough for me to pivot. And then I just push the foot control and it goes back down. So, guess I'm a little, little off here. Nothing like sewing crooked on Facebook Live. And then again, I can hit my scissors button. It ties off. And it cuts my thread for me. So it gives you my tail. So what I always show people is right here I have three layers of denim. I'm going to go six, nine layers at this hump right here. And this is where Foff really excels. So I can put this under there. If I needed more lift, I can do the extra high lift, but I don't really need to on this. And I can, whoops, I do need to go back to straight stitch. Now you'll notice I haven't messed with my tensions. Is that weird? There's no tension dial. You can adjust your tensions if you're working with different threads. But throughout this whole presentation, I'm not going to change my tensions at all. And what's, what happens, and this is where people are usually amazed, about right here is where most people, when you're sewing, have trouble because two thirds of your pressure is on the back one third of your foot and your, it jams, it breaks your needle. Sometimes people try to get that running start to get over that. They hit that hump, knock their machine out of time and it's a big problem, they break needles. Uh, you won't have that problem. The Foff dual feed works like four wheel drive and I have broken needles. I have a standard needle in here. I really should have a denim needle, but it walks right over the top. And then what I love to show is this. I have some Trico. I can go from three layers of heavy denim right here to a single layer of Trico without changing my tensions. And I'm not forcing this through. I'm not, I don't have it stabilized. In real life, I'd probably want to do something to it, but you don't have to. I'm going to hit this and show you what this looks like here. And look at that. It's very nice, very flat. Now, if I disengage my dual feed, now I'm feeding just like any other sewing machine in the world. It's going to put the pressure on the fabric from the top, hoping that the bottom does it. And again, I'm not going to do anything funky here. I'm just going to sew. And I've done this 10,000 times in my life. I'll make a prediction what's going to happen. It's not going to look as good as the first one. I don't know if you can see, but it is much more puckerier than the first one. So that's what I love about this, the dual feed on the FOF. And, and all their machines from the Passport 3 up have this feature. I happen to love this. Now there's something else I'm going to do, and I've never done, I have not shown this for a really long time. So this is, this is a first. Just got it. The, the Foff uh, I found uh, cuts the thread so short, I can't pull up my, I can't grab thread, but I wanna grab a little bit of thread here. There we go. So here we go. I'm gonna pull some thread out here. I don't know, maybe about yay much. All right, the dual feed on the Foff, did you know you can sew on thread with a dual feed? So I'm gonna pick a zigzag. I'm gonna go a slightly bit wider, but not much, like maybe a, yeah, let's go 3.5. Now watch this, this is great. I haven't done this for years, so I'm excited. Okay, here we go. So, so I'm just, the dual feed is catching those strands of thread. And I can just do this forever. So what, why do you want to do that, Rob, is what everybody's asking right now. I'm wondering if anybody in their comments wants to know why you'd want to make your own cording. It's kind of cool. So you can make very nice, and I already did this here, but people always ask me why these little forks are on the button holder. And this has an automatic button holder, by the way, that plugs right into the machine. It's beautiful. But you can make your own corded button holes uh, doing that and it'll match your thread. It's got a little 
bump there, but that's all right. Uh, so you can make really nice button holes uh, with this, and it just is a nice, sometimes people call it a pearl button hole. It's just a really nice look, and you can do it. You don't have to go out and buy cording of different colors. If you've got the thread at home, you can make your own. So that's just kind of a beautiful thing that Dual Feed does. Um, we show this in the store all the time. If you haven't seen a FOF Dual Feed machine in action, come see us. I do want to point something out. These machines, I have a very limited amount of them. They're on the road, so we're, we're pre-ordering these. They're supposed to be in, I'm hoping, by Monday, Tuesday of next week. Uh, so I, I only have about three or four per store. And I can only sell uh, these open stock ones from the quilt show in Colorado. But like I said, uh, for $22.99, we're offering the same bundle. If you're anywhere in the United States, uh, we can sell you that and include the bundle at that price. Those are the uh, Rocky Mountain refurbished machines. They're a couple hundred dollars less. So please reach out. If you want to call me uh, and talk about these machines, we'd be happy to. My number is 720-202-3152. It's kind of weird putting my cell phone on Facebook Live, but we'll do it anyways. If you're looking for to see if we have thread in stock, don't call that cell phone number. Call the store. Just kidding. Well, kind of. So anyways, thank you for showing up and, and watching this. I'm really excited. Please come check it out. Give us a call if you have questions, and we'll see you next time.